What we're watching, President Barack Obama will be holding a town hall meeting in the nation's capital this evening. It follows the deaths of African Americans and five police officers in Dallas. In Waterbury, the city is looking at how it can improve race relations between police officers and the community. News 8's Jason Newton tells us about how the city is trying to come together. Hey, how are you? How's everything going? How's the business? Officer Andrea Carr is a 12-year veteran with Waterbury Police. She's in her element Thursday afternoon, mixing and mingling with the downtown crowd. <laughs> it was nice seeing you. She's part of a renewed push in the Brass City to bring back foot patrols and walking beats. And after a convulsing week of national division between police and citizens, their efforts couldn't have come at a more needed time. We've been able to replenish our foot patrols again to get into the neighborhoods, to get to the businesses, to walk around and just, you know, have the people see the same officers consistently. From small talk with those at the farmer's market to literally helping a little lady cross the street, the efforts are welcome to downtown merchants and business owners. It sends a great signal to people that it's okay to come downtown, to do your business, to enjoy a nice lunch, to walk around and have a good time down here. At any time, Waterbury police could have up to a dozen cops walking a beat in neighborhoods across the city. The faces become as familiar to regulars as the streets they walk. If we see anything from time to time, challenging behavior or, or concerns, I get right on the phone with uh, Officer Carr and she responds immediately. The interactions are crucial to Waterbury's efforts. Top police brass want to build relationships that help in their efforts to build a safer city. Listen, you have to understand that we still have to get out there every day. You know, there's safety concerns for ourselves, but we can't let that affect how we're dealing with the public. In Waterbury, Jason Newton, News 8. And we want to let you know the president and the people in national conversation airs on News 8 this evening, commercial free, starting at 8.